you imagine? A, a dead historical figure came back to life today. What would they say? I have been informed of English history and literature since my death, and I must say I am mostly impressed. But there's one small issue, that being the English have ruined my precious language with their slang. <laughs> I think that people who utter such depressing and disgusting sounds have no right to be anywhere. No right to live. <laughs> Remember that you are a human being with a soul and the divine gift of articulate speech. That your native language is the language of Shakespeare and Milton and the Bible. And don't sit there crooning like a bilious pigeon. Look at them, prisoners of the gutters. the cold-blooded murder of the English tongue. Yes! Oh, noise. <laughs> this is what the British population calls an elementary education. Hear them down in Soho Square, dropping H's everywhere, speaking English any way they like. You ma'am, did you go to school? Why did you say no one taught you to take instead of take. And hear a Yorkshire man, or worse, hear a Cornishman converse. I'd rather hear a choir singing flat. Chickens cackling in the hay, just like this one. Cray, cray. <laughs> I ask you, sir, what sort of word is that? It's Yoss and Cray that keep her in her place. Not her wretched clothes or dirty face. <laughs> Why can't the English teach their children how to speak? This verb class distinction by now should be antique. If you spoke as she does, sir, instead of the way you do, why you might be selling to <laughs> an English way of speaking absolutely classifies him. The moment he speaks, he makes some other Englishmen despise him. One common language I'm afraid will never get. You haven't used it for years. <laughs> Why can't the English teach their children how to speak? Norwegians and a Norwegian. The Greeks are taught their Greek. In France, every Frenchman knows his language from ancient said. The French never cared what they do, actually, as long as they pronounce it properly. <laughs> Arabians learn Arabian with the speed of summer lightning. The Hebrews learn it backwards, which is absolutely frightening. But you proper English, you're regarded as a freak. Oh, why can't the English? 